Here I'll be showing you how to remove your status bar on iOS 11.0.3. Let me go into 11.0.3, that's the version I'm on, latest one. So to do this, you want to go swipe up on, so this is at iOS 11, you can see right there. Is you want a 3D touch like two seconds immediately after you click on 3D touch on one of the icons, just like the calculator. You want to do like that, sort of. It might take some time, but eventually you'll get it. So there's a status bar. 3D touch and it'll just fade away like that. You can see it's gone when you click the when you click the home button, it comes back. But just a simple glitch if you want. So you're not supposed to get that effect, but it does take some time. So don't yeah, give this like a dislike because it didn't work for you. It does work. It just faded away. So I just uh, you can keep on trying, just practice and you will get it. Just follow along one too. And just fades away. So swipe up, and sometimes immediately it just goes away again. If you're fast enough, it's gonna go away. And when you do this, it actually like um, not lets you go to back to the control center or even the notification center. It's gonna ban that, or it's not gonna let you. So let me show you that it won't work. There we go. There it's gone. And now when I try to swipe up. It doesn't do anything, neither the control center, it doesn't go down. But when you click the home button, it will come back. So, it's another glitch as it won't let you go to the notification center, or even the control center. So I hope this helped you out, just showing you a glitch that I found personally. So, if you go on and try it out, you can go check and do it right now. And you can share this video with others, so... It might not work for you fast because it does take some practice to get this to work. And so it just fades away. So I ho just hope you enjoy this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you're new. So thanks for watching. Peace.